Well, this popular tourist attraction right here, how beautiful is she? It reopened today, the Queen Mary welcoming visitors after a three year break and after a little bit of a makeover, KCAL's Jake Reiner gives us the tour. Now let's count down these final seconds. For the first time in three years. Three, three two, two, one. one. <laughs> ah! The Queen Mary in Long Beach is back open. Welcome back home and welcome aboard. This is a great day. Our team has worked really hard to get the ship open. Hi. Hi. The first shipmates featured some of the most enthusiastic vessel visitors. I just think that Queen Mary is one of the nicest ships to be on. Like these boys, a part of a ship club. This is special because I'm here with my crew and my friends. At about 137 feet longer than the Titanic, this retired British ocean liner steamed across the Atlantic from 1936 to 1967, transporting the rich, the famous, and for a period of time, World War II soldiers. It's been docked in Long Beach since 67, celebrating its 56th anniversary here. As she has survived a depression, a world war, and now we can add a global pandemic to that list. This is, this is wild to me. Danny Wrangle, a Queen Mary tour guide of nine years, also survived the pandemic. It's also where you can watch a nice giant green wave wash right over the bow of the ship. He was furloughed in March of 2020, so he too is making his grand return after three years. The whole goal was always to come back here. Why? Uh, the Queen Mary kind of grabs a heart, grabs a hold of your soul and your heart, and it really just leaves an impression on you. An impression the Queen Mary crew hopes is lasting, like this new coat of paint. The goal? To go from a soft opening now to a stern one down the line before they can finally take a bow. We're going to make sure that the Queen has uh, what she needs in order to have a long life and continue to be a destination for our region. The executive director says their hope is to open the Queen Mary fully with the restaurants and hotels at some point this year, although they don't have a target date. In the meantime, you can sign up for any one of the three tours on board. Aboard the Queen Mary, I'm Jake Reiner, KCAL News.